coming up in this video. Push the door, yeah. Well done. Wow. I hope you brought a change of clothes, because these are the 30 scary videos that'll make you pee your pants. Number 30. Evil Poltergeist Dennis and Tim team up in this video on YouTube channel Nerf Paranormal, and they think this poltergeist is pushing them to do dangerous things. Upon entering the abandoned site, they find something out of place. Mm -hmm. What? You as they explore, Dennis sees something pass by. Then as they enter, If that wasn't scary enough, this happens. I agree that it's time to leave, but will the evil poltergeist let them? With nowhere to go, they try to escape from the roof. But they decide against it. They re-enter the house and leave out the window instead. That was a close call, and I agree with Dennis that the poltergeist was trying to drive them out via a risky route. I'm glad they didn't listen though. Number 29 30 East Drive. I first heard about 30 East Drive in Pantafrac through YouTuber Shadow Man. It's said to be haunted by a somewhat evil entity named Fred or the Black Monk. Many have explored the haunted location in the UK, and here's some of the best captures in this home. The first short one comes from YouTuber Thomas Matthew, who captured a door closing. That's it, that's it. Push the door, yeah. Well done. Wow. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Wow. This next video is even creepier. JDH Spooks Paranormal captured a mysterious hand. It's not your left hand. It's not your left hand. It's there. This video from Christopher Chell shows a paranormal device rolling off of a chair. Yeah. So we've got a cat ball on the chair. No one's in the room. You suddenly get your light up. We've been sat on that chair for a good while, but nothing should affect it. Purple Bee Paranormal recorded this video where the broken radio suddenly revives itself. With the radio. It's the radio, come here. Give me the radio don't work. It's bloody singing to itself. But this last clip tops them all. Lee Brady shares this footage that was filmed by the property's cleaner, Sarah B. I have just seen some. I have just seen some. Right, that's it. I'm off down. I can't take them all. I am off frigging down. This piece of evidence really hit it home for me. I'm entirely convinced that 30 East Drive is 100% haunted, and if this is the ghost known as Fred...
I don't want to know. I think it's time to get the heck out of there. Number 28, Shadow Figure. Now this may sound far-fetched, but this TikTok will leave you terrified. Shared by TikTok Paranormal and originally posted by Um Sam, I guess, this young woman was scaring her sister when she herself was scared by a shadow, but not just any shadow. Hey, let's go get my sister. Hey, Jack. Watch for the shadow person here. What are you doing? <laughs> Got you, me. Good. Go, 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 go. Did you see it? Oh my Danny, 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 Danny. What, 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 what? Literally, someone just ran in here, I think. Huh? Someone just ran in your room. Is it an intruder or a paranormal figure? I can't tell for sure, but if this video hasn't made you pee your pants, I don't know what will. Number 27, Cousin's Face. After a series of unexpected passings in his family, YouTuber Slightly Scared 2012 experienced this. Do you see a face in the fabric? The YouTuber believes it's his departed cousin's face. The cousin in question passed away, falling from a highway overpass and within hours, this face appeared on the seat of the chair while the YouTuber was sitting in it. I wish we had a picture of his cousin to compare, but nevertheless, I definitely see a face here, but whether it's pareidolia or not is the big question. Number 26, Woodland Creatures. Beloved YouTuber Erwin Saunders comes across some of the world's most enchanting creatures. In this video, he's spotted by the woodland folk as he tries to capture them on camera. Well, he's sort of muddling around. We just... This isn't easy. Even though he's caught, he does manage to capture them. So there they are. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, he's obviously seen that. So I better just make a run for it. But after making a run for it, he spots them again. But what are these woodland creatures? I'm not sure, but they're truly fascinating. And with any luck, Irwin will have more footage for us soon. Fairfield County Infirmary YouTube channel Dayton Haunted Explorers dive into the Fairfield County Infirmary and the amount of activity they get is intense. After setting a camera up in the infirmary, they capture a series of unexplained sounds. I came in here earlier on accident. I did not know this bathroom was in here, and I don't know why, but it really creeps me out. They capture even more activity in the attic. Later, even more EVPs are captured. Then, as they attempt to communicate with the spirits, the windows start to rattle. One of the crew enters this room, and she captures a blurry figure on camera. 
After feeling like she was grabbed a couple times, the crew packs it up to leave, but the spirits aren't done yet. Were the spirits trying to get them? They may not have succeeded this time, but I'm guessing they'll have better luck with the people who enter this haunted place next. Number 24. Haunted Jailhouse Would you ever do an alone challenge inside a haunted jailhouse? YouTuber Chelsea Luna did, and she's about to regret it. As she enters the cell, she hears an unexplained noise. So, if you remember, this is the cell. What was that? Oh, that was weird. It sounded like somebody was like walking. And as she continues her tour, another noise is heard. Isolation. So what you would do is you would go down here, down through this. What freak was that? What was that? The sounds get progressively more aggressive. You guys, where did that come from? <gasps> And unrelenting. I feel like something's behind me. I felt this presence. I felt a huge presence early. Then she hears voices. Hearing voices. Later, as Chelsea sits in a cell telling a story, she is scared out of her mind. And they ended up giving her, I think, a hundred bucks. <laughs> no, 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 no. Hundred bucks. Hundred bucks. I think it's safe to say that Chelsea has won this alone challenge. I think it's best to leave before the spirits attach themselves to her. Number 23, The Cord. This one's a real head scratcher. This Redditor shared this video of a USB cable with a life of its own. Let's take a look. Let's see it again, slower this time. The cord is still for about 20 seconds and then becomes active again. If you zoom in on the cable, it does look like there's something attached to it about 2 inches below the head. But you can't see the string, so I'm hesitant to say that's not just a reflection of light on the cord at certain angles. I can't offer a resounding verdict on this one. What do you think it is? Number 22. Spine Building Ghosts YouTuber Tim Morozov has faced off with many an entity in his paranormal investigations. This time he encounters ghosts in the Spine Building. As he sets up his cameras, he's quickly met with some paranormal activity. Even after this, he continues in his investigation. The spirits seem to want him out, but Tim stays.
Just as he thinks his fears are unfounded, this happens. My And then his camera keeps freezing right before something much worse unfolds. Luckily, Tim gets out alive. This time, I am sold that there was definitely something evil in this building. Whether ghost or demon, I'm not so sure but it definitely wanted Tim's soul all to itself. Number 21, Ghost Children. YouTuber Amy's Crypt visits the haunted Ferrar Elementary School in this creepy video. Upon entering, they're warned by the spirits. They're told very clearly what hides behind a locked door. Can you tell us what is behind this door? It looks like there's a man in the tunnel, Jared. I wonder who Bill is and why is his door locked after receiving this message through the spirit box. For us. Pot. Did it say pot? Pot. How come it didn't say it out loud? It did say it out loud. Oh. I've heard people talk about little kids haunting here. They find the message again spelled out for them. <gasps> pot. Oh, that is crazy. As they continue their exploration, they hear movement. Celeste here. In another room, they hear tapping. <gasps> okay. And then as they enter the bathroom. Later, while speaking through the spirit box, they receive this message. Okay. I don't I don't know if I heard my name, but the bathrooms are down there. Can you tell us about the bathrooms? Did something happen in the school's bathroom? I feel like the spirits are really trying to tell Amy and Jared into their story. The clues are there, but putting them together is the hard part. Number 20, live stream horror. Ever get the feeling that you're being watched? Aside from your virtual viewers, I mean. YouTuber Scary Field shared this freaky live stream, which is trending in the Hindi speaking YouTube community. A woman was recording a live stream, but she didn't realize she already had an audience. Watch the doorway behind her. A shadowy figure passes by. It appears semi-transparent without substance. When the woman gets up to check on it, she's in for a rude awakening. I'm guessing this isn't the type of subscriber she wanted, but to be fair, maybe the ghost just wanted her own 15 minutes of fame. The original source of this video is unknown, but I suspect it's from a movie. That being said, what would you do if this happened to you? Number 19, Ghost of the Pokuantes. YouTuber Extinct File encounters the ghost of the Pokuantes in this creepy video. As the team explores the abandoned place, they spot the ghost in a doorway. A little further along, they capture an unexplained sound. And then another. They believe the spirit here was pregnant. 
quizá estaba embarazada, güey. Estabas embarazada. They then hear wailing in the distance. It continues for minutes. After a while, the crying stops, but then starts up again. And then this happens. No mames, güey. No mames, come on, dos. When they enter the enclosure, the figure is gone. Where did she go? I'm convinced they truly encountered the ghost of the Pokeontes, and if they did, they'd better hope these spirits didn't attach themselves. Number 18. Light Balls What are these strange so-called light balls that keep setting this Redditor's cameras off? Redditor's Spambone is wondering if the Reddit community has any theories. Well, let's see what we can come up with as well. Let's take a look. This goes on for two minutes. Sometimes two light balls appear simultaneously. Some say it's obviously a bug. Others think it's a web of some kind. Still, others say it's a laser pointer or a reflection of some other light source. Practically, no one thinks this is an orb or paranormal in any way. And neither do I. I'm firmly in the spider or cobweb camp. What do you think it is? Number 17. Demonic activity. When you experience regular poltergeist activity in your home, monitoring it becomes top priority. YouTuber Donnie Drunkard shares this VR 360 video from a GoPro Max of his home's demonic activity. You can hear faint knocks or footsteps repeatedly. More unexplained sounds unfold. Not long after, there's a major smashing noise, followed by REM pod activity. You can also hear faint voices at this point, maybe from a TV turning on. Not long after, this happens. And again, it sounds like the TV has been turned on or someone is speaking. The voice comes and goes throughout the remainder of the clip, but turning 360, you can't see anything on. And lastly, the spirits play a short tune. This video is particularly unsettling to me because you can see all four corners of the room at any time, so you know nobody is pulling the strings. I'm convinced that Donnie's house is haunted, and considering the noises, the demon doesn't sound friendly. Number 16. Old Owner's Spirit Is the former owner of this shop still at work? That's what the Redditor who posted this thinks, and he captured some evidence of it on camera. First, let's take a look at the clip. Watch for the clipboard. Something appears to yank it off of the nail where it was placed and onto a hot plate in the meat market.
Let's see it again. This isn't the only thing the spirit has been observed doing. He also knocks things over, turns big mirrors around, and appears as a dark shadow out of the corner of people's eyes. I personally don't think this one is paranormal, but if there were more pieces of evidence like this, I could definitely change my mind. Number 15. Burger King Ghost Nuggets The last thing you'd want for your Burger King chicken nuggets is a ghost playing with them. But we don't always get what we want. YouTuber Karaoke Batman shares the security footage of a supposed phantom playing around in this Burger King kitchen. Watch behind the worker. Like. Something threw a basket of chicken nuggets from the counter behind him. Watch again closely. <laughs> oh my god. Like. Since we can't see where the basket of nuggets fell from, I don't know if it simply toppled over or if some mysterious being threw it. I think we'd need further evidence of ghostly activity to draw any sort of conclusion on this one. Number 14. Most Haunted Hospital YouTuber Exploring with Josh spent the night in this building, one of the UK's most haunted hospitals. It's called the Bonnie Garth Workhouse Slash Asylum. Up to 300 people lost their lives in or died. Or 300 died people could be lying. At first, the explorers scare each other. Yes, I bet. No one got my reaction. Dude. But later they discover it's not each other they should be afraid of. You can let me know. I'm gonna keep going. Oh, oh, yeah, oh, okay. You ready? After receiving that confirmation, they get a verbal one as well. Or is there more like you here? You like us. According to the spirit's communication, there are more like him around. Did one of these others touch Seth? We're back in the dark. We're finding the stairs. Uh, something just f touched Yo. my back. Yo, chill, chill, Jesus. chill. For real? I swear to f bro. Dude, I'm telling you, this one. I believe the spirit when he says he's not alone. The fact that multiple devices were triggered when the spirit was questioned makes me think this isn't just coincidence. Something is residing here. Number 13. Tech Savvy Phantom A tech savvy phantom is entering the chat. YouTuber Amitov Paranormal Tech YT went live on his YouTube channel and his REM pod activated. So he set up a security camera in the room at night. This is what happens. An invisible entity enters. And not long after this happens. A light turns on and off. This footage is creepy for sure, but is it paranormal? Or can it be explained? I'm not sure, but I'm looking forward to seeing what Amitav captures next. Number 12. Jin Witch Credited to at Paranormal204, YouTuber Deranged TV shares this video of what they say is a Jin Witch. The strange spirit is sitting on the hillside in the dark. <laughs> The men are digging a hole in the dirt for some unknown reason. <laughs> it 
It cuts from there. Well, I'm curious about the Jin Witch. Sitting in the darkness, I'm almost more curious about what they're digging up in the first place. Are the two things related? Let's hope there's a part three. Number 11, Live in Spirit. YouTuber Par Abnormal Films was filming in her storage unit when she captured the Live in Spirits getting up to their antics. You just made that. Oh my. <sighs> okay, yeah. You just made that bottle um, shake. <laughs> oh my. Okay, yeah, I'm done. The spirits are first heard fidgeting with items in the room before the window bursts open. Just made that. Oh my. <sighs> okay, yeah. You just made that bottle um, shake. <laughs> oh my. Okay, yeah, I'm done. Yeah, I'd be done too. There's something in here. Animals? Maybe. Spirits? Definitely. Number 10. Mount Morris Mystery House. The YouTube team from Spirit Walk Paranormal investigates the Mount Morris Mystery House in this creepy video. The team gets some activity right away. They then capture what they believe is a disembodied voice. And then a greeting is heard. And then another message is heard. The activity at the beginning is most convincing to me. The rest of the disembodied voices sound like they could just be movement from some mechanical parts. Their cameras or equipment, maybe. What do you think? Number 9. Creepy Basement. Who's there? Redditor Sal26 Serrano says remodeling was being done in this vacant apartment complex of four, and the owner of the property was downstairs with him at the time. So who is making this noise? Did you hear it? There's definitely someone there, but whether they're supposed to be there or not is the next question. My guess would be this place has squatters. Number 8. Haunted Insane Asylum This clip was submitted to the Chills Narrator subreddit and was originally uploaded to YouTube by Hunting the Unknown. As the team investigates the Haunted Insane Asylum, they hear something. They can give us a sign. While they indicate it's a knock, it sounds like a loud grunt to me. Later, as they continue walking, footsteps are heard beside them or nearby that seem out of place with their own. Next, they hear something off screen. As they continue on, one viewer claims to see a figure in the window at this point. Look up and to the right. Listen, taking some more investigation. While I do see the shadow, I think it's just the wall jutting out, although it does look a bit like a figure. I think this shadow can be explained, but the subtle footsteps and other noises are harder to pinpoint. This place definitely gives me the creeps. Number 7. Lincoln's Haunted Tomb Is one of America's greatest presidents still roaming the earth? YouTuber Soul Searching thinks so. She visited President Lincoln's tomb at the Oak Ridge Cemetery in Springfield, Illinois. The place is said to be haunted. Let's see if it is. Right away, Shannon gets a response to her inquiries. Walk up to me. Oh, I heard a noise. Was that you, Mr. Lincoln? I heard a noise. 
when she asks the spirit to knock. Can you knock on this? There we go. It answers a moment later. Unless there's construction going on inside the tomb, I don't know what would explain the knocking in response. My thoughts are that Lincoln Spirit remains here. Number 6. Under the garage door. Redditor asserted skirted motion-activated cameras detected motion in the middle of the night, but it isn't something I've ever seen before. Keep an eye on the bottom of the garage door. Here it is again, more slowly. Something appears to slip beneath the garage door, but it looks like a shadow. My guess would be that this is an unknown shadow entity. The way the shadow reaches out is even tentacle-like. What do you think it is? Number 5. Woodstock Unidentified Flying Object Lingering above the colony venue in Woodstock, New York, YouTuber Woodstock Web Girl captured this strange unidentified flying object on camera. What is that? Here's a closer look. One YouTuber says it's an airplane, but I've never seen an airplane appear round in form, even from a great distance. Airplanes also don't generally hang in the same spot for a long period of time. Well, I can't say for sure that it's extraterrestrial. It's certainly unidentifiable and flying. So it is technically an unidentified flying object. Number 4. Paranormal Activity Donna Aries has some of the most convincing paranormal activity footage on YouTube. This is yet another piece of evidence. Donna explains. Just doing a bit of the Ouija board and the key started moving, so... Watch the keys hanging on the wall. Just as I was putting the Ouija board on the table. I don't, don't really give a f what you people think. Some YouTubers note that Donna left the planchette on top of the board by itself. Did this open a portal to the spirit and encourage it to become more active? I know you have to end the session before removing the planchette, but I'm assuming Donna already did that. Nevertheless, leaving the planchette on the board does seem to me like it could invite entities in. Number 3. Haunted House While exploring the Fairy Plantation in Virginia, disturbing paranormal evidence was captured by Redditor WTCW Paranormal, who runs a YouTube channel of the same name. First, the team captured some audio evidence using a paranormal device. Where are you from? Oh. It sounds like there's evil present. Then, as they continue exploring, audible footsteps are heard. Later, when they're using dousing rods to communicate with the spirits, something off-screen communicates louder. <laughs> to me, the noises add credence to the first message the guys received. They are in the fiery depths below, and they may just be trapped there. Number 2. Ghost at the door. While YouTuber John Ator's new cat was sleeping on the bed, something strange happens. Note that no one was home at the time. The door swings open of its own accord. No one is there, though. It looks to me that it swings open with force, which is the strangest part about this clip. If there was a draft, I think it would have eased open slowly. Is this evidence of a ghost? Maybe not. 
but how would you explain it otherwise? I've got a challenge for you. Since you've made it this far, why not like this video and hit subscribe in the next 5 seconds? Because I upload 4 new scary videos every week. If you're curious about what I look like in real life, then go to my Instagram at DylanIsChillinYT and tap that follow button to find out. Number 1. Confronted by Demon the team from Extinct File believes they were confronted by a demon who is pretending to be a priest. As they're first exploring the haunted place, they get an eerie vibe right away. When they ask the spirit what to do, it provides a resounding answer. Dígame lo que quiera decirme. As he prays and then starts to hear noises, he realizes something else is there. <laughs> Later, they're explaining what happened when they hear the noise again. <laughs> The demon doesn't let up. <laughs> then, when they're about to leave, this happens. Oh, my luz, se, se me está queriendo apagar. ¿Qué pasó? No mames, cámara 2. Está sangrando, güey. A ver, a ver qué. What caused this cruise member's nosebleed? I'd say it's all too obvious. It was definitely that grunting demon, and who knows if it's finished with them. <laughs> 